I got more of those? Okay. Alright, um. Yeah. Waiting for that, kitty cat. Ah. Uh, <laughs> I'll say this. All right, we'll go there. We're gonna see the kitty cat. I'm back! Sorry it took so long. My carry would only navigate to the other exit farther away. Oh, right! I saw on my phone that the demolition was delayed. But then the stupid train got away, so Nicole and the others are still in danger. Well, what should we do now? Nekomata, I know you're anxious, but before we try to rescue the others, we have to talk. Yeah. Uh, what's going on? Why the sudden change in tone? The hair on my ears is standing up. Nekomata, this is important, so we want you to be honest. What kind of trouble did you and the cunning hairs get yourselves into exactly? Didn't the news say the train was transporting explosives? Why would it be carrying a bunch of fake pubsec officers? And you reacted so quickly to the enemy. Not like something you would expect from someone in shock. Be straight with us. Are you trying to set us up? Um, I'll say this. Nekomata, if you're hiding anything, please just tell us. We're reasonable people. You mean it? You, you'll really hear me out. Yeah. If you want faith and support, you'd better answer my sister truthfully and tell us what you're hiding. I'm not trying to hide anything from you guys. I really didn't know there were people on that train. It's just that I've seen guys dressed like that somewhere else. You're totally right. The Cunning Harris and I are in big trouble this time. But we just wanted to save people. You never mentioned this before. You never mentioned this before? Do it. Whew. I'm starting to get used to the ether concentration here. I wasn't feeling too good when we first got in. Hey, we might not have come across any strong ethereals yet, but the dead end butcher is around here somewhere, so stay on your toes. Especially Billy. You totally got carried away in that last battle. How many times have I told you not to make a ruckus? We need to get to the Red Fang Gang's base and finish this commission. Can't you be more like Nekomara? Fast and quiet? <laughs> even if the Dead End Butcher did come along, it might not even notice her at all. <laughs> what I gotta say? We can't be blood nine lives. That counts for something. Everyone wait. You see the railroad tracks on the side of the road? It's not just broken off here. A gaping hole has been clawed out. Oh, she, she's right! Looks like the dead end butcher has been here. We might come across it if we keep going. That's no good. Since there's signs of it here, let's find another way around. Nekomata, will you see if your carrot can suggest another way to the Red Fang Gang's base? Yeah, I can find another route, but the path we're on is the most direct. I know you're anxious to find your family heirloom, but this is no normal mission. Safety first, as they say. Yeah! What, <laughs> what's wrong? You sound like someone stepped on your tail. <laughs> Over there! I saw a little kid run past just now! Huh? What are you talking about? 
about? You know we're in the Dead End Hollow, right? There have been cases of small children entering the hollows by mistake. But the direction you're pointing, Nekomata, is the original route we were planning on taking. Hey! You think I'm just saying it to make you take that path? I really did see a kid! A little girl in a blue top with brown hair and a ponytail! Hmm, that's a pretty detailed description. Maybe she really did see her. Even if we believe you saw the child, are you suggesting we go save her first? I should remind you, this is not what we were commissioned to do. What's that supposed to mean? It's not part of the commission, so you'll just ignore a child lost in the hollow? <laughs> I knew you were boring, but cold-blooded too? If you're worried about not getting paid, don't be. I'm not like you. I'll pay you extra for looking for the girl. <sighs> 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 I didn't expect you to not be a bad person. Oh, uh, huh? Oh, that had me scared just now. <laughs> yeah, me too. When she pointed out the child, I really thought her next line was gonna be, Forget the kid! I want my family heirloom! <laughs> but this kitty's a kind employer. If you really are determined to save the girl, Nekomata, then I'll go with you. You don't need to use the commission fee as a bargaining chip. Epi! You should at least ask me when it comes to commission fees. <sighs> Guess it can't be helped. But I agree, we can't just leave a kid in a place like this. A kid's aptitude for ether is underdeveloped, and she can't save herself. Every minute spent in the hollow is dangerous, not to mention the dead-end butcher is around here somewhere. <laughs> Let's get going! Time and space change fast in the hollows! If we don't hurry, we'll never find her! What are you waiting for, Nikomata? Let's go! Uh... Oh! Coming! They really... seem to be sincere. Uh, oh man, why am I thinking about this now? Alright, looks like we're fighting. Let go! There's so many ethereals around. That kid really worries me. Luckily, I didn't see any signs of them on the way over. Still, hopefully we can find her, and fast. I'll take care of them. Let's switch, Ambi! Nice one, Billy! Alright, we're going this way. Oh, shoot! Dang, that came out of nowhere! I'm gonna switch. than normal people, but my visual components are pretty good, too. Hey, do you all think there are more and more claw marks around here? We've been coming across stronger ethereals, too. Now that you mention it... We can't keep going like this. How can we save anyone when we're in danger ourselves? We need a plan. Nekomata, are you sure you saw her? Why is it every time you see her, we find nothing? The hollow changes so quickly. By the time we've gone over, things have already warped. It's not my fault. If we want to catch her, you guys just need to keep up. Negative. We don't have the physical advantages when it comes to running like you do. In our current situation, we should reserve our energy to escape if we encounter the dead-end butcher. Oh? 
Oh! What's that supposed to mean? You talk about saving people. But when the time comes, you can only think of yourselves. That's not true. Really? Then you mean you aren't confident in your abilities? Uh, are you gonna pressure her now? I can't pretend I didn't hear that. If I get serious, even Billy using his fuel reserves can't beat me. I can't pretend I didn't hear that, Andy. No problem, then. We'll just run after the girl from now on. I'm more than happy to. What? Wait! Isn't anyone gonna ask my opinion? <laughs> I like the cat. Hey. Fine. All right. No. Wonder if it's not a kid at all. And it just looks like a kid. deep within the dead end hollow i pooped we've been riding for so long you guys have pretty good stamina weren't you the one who said the only way to catch up with the kid was to run now you're the first to complain on second thought this area is about to be demolished so the residents should have been evacuated how did a kid get in uh, th th there's no such thing as g g g ghosts and don't do movie promos at a time like this really can you guys not say stuff like that huh? wait a sec don't run wait for us uh-huh wait that can't be right there really is a kid in the dead end hollow Hurry, faster! We gotta keep moving! The girl's just up ahead! Hey, I feel like that could be a trap, though. Right back at ya! Andy, I'll cover you! What the heck? 
Whoa, what the heck? A pretty risky, but cool landing. Oh, shoot. <laughs> Nicole. Nicole. Yeah, you're on him. I hear you. I've barely been sitting on you for a minute. Stop complaining. Huh? Isn't this Canvas Street? Then these people are... Wait. This is the blast zone. It was supposed to be cleared. Why are there so many people? How many are there? Over a hundred at least. Me and Envy only did a rough count at whoever was willing to come out and speak to us. There could be even more. I thought that Vision said they cleared everyone out days ago. Yeah, it could be a lie. They say they don't know what's going on. They haven't been able to contact anyone on the outside for a week. I'm guessing Vision has set up jamming devices. Yeah, so what is this? When exactly is Vision planning to evacuate everyone? Children, you must be coming from the city. Are you bringing any news? Excuse me, who are you? Oh, the little girl you just saved from the hollow is my granddaughter. Thank you for rescuing her. She's always been naughty. She thinks she can sneak into the hollow safely just because she's got ether aptitude. Yesterday, because a public security officer wouldn't tell her the exact time, she came up with an idea to go to New Eridu and ask around. I took my eyes off of her for one second and she ran into the hollow. Um, excuse me, an officer? Did you say an officer came by? Yes, that's right. Yesterday, my granddaughter and a few neighbors got tired of waiting and headed to ask Vision what was going on. But an officer stopped them before they got there. Mm. They said nobody could get through because explosives were being handled nearby. And once things were ready, a train would be coming for us. Most of us here are old, sick, and disabled. Other than my granddaughter, none of us have any aptitude for ether. So we can't go anywhere. We were told to wait. So but oh, shoot. it doesn't make sense. Yeah. How can something as big as a mass evacuation of residents not be scheduled in advance? They just left everyone waiting for notice. And I haven't heard of public security being involved in the project before. Miss, you mean to say... That public security officer who stopped the residents is suspicious. Huh. There has to be more to it than this. I remember them saying Vision Corporation won the bid thanks to a much lower cost. I get it. The Metro Renovation Project is one of the most talked about in New Eridu. It's technically and financially demanding they still have to relocate the residents. But if Vision just dealt with the residents along with the demolition, that it'd save costs. So what you're saying is, Vision has just abandoned us all here? Vision always wanted to perform well enough to enter tops, but I never thought they'd stoop so low for a seat at the table. expect this when I took on the commission. Fine, sure. We came into the dead end hollow looking for something and yeah, saving a kid along the way is a good thing, but oh, a small odd job agency can't take on a massive corporation. So, what do you two think? I'll do whatever you say, boss. But Anby. I didn't expect to agree with Nekomata on this matter. I'm staying. I understand Nicole's thinking, but I can't follow this time. This is my chance. I won't make the same mistake again. Is that so? Going against a corporation? Andy, you really hold at my heartstrings! They're the Vision Corporation! They may be big enough to join the Tops Alliance! Just think of the money we could squeeze out of them if we threatened to expose them. Quickly, Billy, Envy, go tell 
each of these gold nuggets, uh, I mean victims, that the cunning hares are willing to represent them in their lawsuit for compensation. Don't just stand there. Get everyone to sign the authorization forms. Collect them one by one. And Nekomara, I know you're our client, but I have something for you to do too. Uh, me? You want to save everyone, right? You know the area and you're the most agile. Here, take my bangboo. I want you to take it someplace and get help. Oh, so that's where the, we came in, the MCs. Okay, that's everything. Nicole told me they'd stay in the construction area collecting victim signatures and monitoring Vision's movements. After leaving the others, I went back through the dead-end hollow and came straight to your store. Please, Faithin! You have to help me save them! Yeah, you don't need to tell me that! I made up my mind ever since I left! <sighs> okay, if the client has made up her mind, there's nothing more to say. Take a look at this map. Speaking of which, the train that we delayed earlier is almost at its destination. So there'll be even more people to guard the residents. Look, those trapped residents have no ether aptitude, so the mercenaries don't expect anyone coming from behind. How clever! The train itself has some resistance to corruption, so as long as we get them out of the hollow quickly, they will get affected! Yeah! No time to waste. Let's get started then. Right! Then, it's crunch time! Yeah, yeah, payback, bitch. Ah, oh, what is it now? Okay. But not right now, hold on. Oh shoot. Well I could do the math thing. Alright, we go here. At least we could teleport to somewhere. Alright, give me a second. Alright, let's continue. Still use them. We're still playing with these guys. Alright. Oh, well, now we're in the rain. Ooh, this music. And be here. I've got the last few signatures. Thanks. No, I should be thanking you. We were really at our wit's end before you kids arrived. But when is the young lady you sent for help coming back? She's been gone a long time. You're right. I hope she didn't run into trouble. Uh, okay, they might be having gotten to drop on us, but we are ready for anything. Are you the current for us? Concern for us. I'm so happy. Unless you were just talking about Nekomata. That voice. It's the proxy. Yeah. Oh, it was us. I thought it would be any this time. That could got me confused. Sorry to keep everyone waiting. I see. So you plan to stop the demolition by blocking the train, but you didn't expect to find a bunch of vision reinforcements. Huh, this means Vision is at the point of no return. They'll do whatever it takes to stop the residents from getting out. But the proxy's plan to seize the train could work. <laughs> it's true what they say about Faithen's wisdom and courage. Ma'am, you've heard our plan. Now, we have something to ask of you. We need you to get all the residents together at the platform nearby. Don't worry, I'll tell them. When the time comes, they'll be there. Right. 
By the way, there was an old Red Fang Gang base in the hollow somewhere around here. Have you heard of it? Why do you want to know all of a sudden? Are you thinking about the community fees? Ooh, I don't even know. I'll say this. What's with the abrupt change of topic? Why do you want to know all of a sudden? Nekomata's commission fee. Uh, uh, I mean, we still haven't found her family heirloom. I thought maybe the residents here might know something. I know the place. Everyone around here knows the Red Fang Gang. <laughs> Is that so? Yes. Since they made their name on Canvas Street, everyone here is related to them one way or another. In the early days, they weren't what they are now. Back then, they took in lots of orphans, taught them to read and defend themselves. They often stood up for those in need. Mm. They said they'd protect this place forever. Unfortunately, a few years passed and that silver boy changed. He looked down on the slums and led the gang to do some awful things. Oh, that's why. As things got worse, many in the gang couldn't stand to see what it had become. Many of them left the gang. Soon after, the Red Fang Gang moved out of here. We don't want anything to do with the Red Fang Gang anymore. Silver fell into the hollow while being chased by public security. He only has himself to blame. Huh? What did you say? What's the matter, young lady? We want nothing to do with them. What's wrong with that? No, not that. You said Silver fell into the hollow being chased by the pub sec? Wasn't he killed by the cunning hairs? Uh, w uh, about that. <laughs> <laughs> Little kitten. <laughs> Uh, I mean, Miss Client, you can understand, right? We wanted to tell you, but each time you looked at us with those big, cute eyes, we just couldn't. We're sorry! We were there, but it was public security who did it. So it wasn't you guys? Don't worry, Nekomata. Even if public security hadn't intervened, he was no match for the cunning hairs. Ahem. Even though it was you who got it wrong to begin with, we're somewhat responsible as well. How about we give you a small discount on your family heirloom commission? What? Uh, anyway, let's put this aside for now. First things first, we have to get that train and evacuate the residents out of here. Okay, let's go. We made it. Vision Corporation has its monitoring station here. The train is also nearby. To avoid alerting anyone, I found a secret way in. And here it is. Alright. Let's get moving. Sure! The Starlight Knight's here to punish the bad guys! <laughs> this path's blocked. <laughs> we can't go this way. Let's take the secret way then. Try to sneak over to the monitoring station. Not bad, Faithen. You're so prepared. Oh, shoot. Hold on. Ah, screw that. Things going according to plan. Great. The route seems to be going well. Oh, I'm fighting. Guys, we're near the train. Our objective is simple. Take out the guards, seize the train, and head on out. Roger that! <laughs> uh, I think the pressure is getting to Ambie. She's lost her mind. Not quite. 
I'm guessing she's humming background music to match the atmosphere. Must have learned it from another movie. Enough with the soundtrack, Anby. Everyone knows how important this next fight is. Proxy, we'll leave driving the train to you. How are preparations on your side? I've only got a driver's license, but I'll try my best. Don't worry, Master. I'll give you detailed instructions. Oh, a kind. Then, let's go! We'll catch them off guard! that you bastard you old piece of shit Nekomata, take him with us Andy and Billy have gone to the driver's compartment proxy let the residents know to be waiting at the platform I don't care what it takes just stop this thing at once what D director Perlman sir don't worry I've blown up the only railroad route leading to New Eridu they can't get out Nicole, this isn't good. Enemy reinforcements have surrounded us. What should we do? Come in, Director Perlman. Unknown intruders attack near the train. We've suffered some losses. <laughs> this dude has his uses after all. Right. The tracks are gone. And even with the train, we can't get everyone out of the hollow now. No, I wasn't laughing at you. I happened to find it. During the fighting. Find what? That's you with... Wait... That's Silver... From the Red Fang Gang? That's right. I lied to you. I'm not the Red Fang Gang's enemy, but one of the orphans who used to live near Canvas Street that they adopted. The Red Fang Gang used to have ideals. They all wanted to protect their home. No matter how disappointed I was in the Red Fang Gang, Silver took me in. The Red Fang Gang was the closest I ever had to a family. But you're not exactly what I expected. And now that I know Silver's death wasn't your fault, I have no reason to want revenge. Oh. I've made up my mind. <laughs> I'm gonna go negotiate with Vision. Miss Client! Nekomata! Hey! Come back! Nekomata! Nekomata! Envy! Billy! Open the door! We can't, boss! It's too tough! Perlman's people must have reinforced the doors and windows in the car! Damn it! Shh! Listen. There are people talking outside. Some time outside the train car. I've made myself clear, haven't I? Now, I'm gonna take your boss with me on foot through the hollow to New Eridu to negotiate with your command center. At the same time, all your men, all of you, 
will stop blocking the residence and leave with me. So, if you don't want anything bad to happen to your boss, you better find him an anti-corruption device. And the fastest route through the hollow! Nicole! Everyone's counting on you! Some moments later... Uh, we did it! We're out! Son of a... Getting through the door took too long. Nikomana and Perlman have already gone into the hollow! Harry, give me a... Uh, I can't say her name! God damn it! Barry, I need to know Nekomata's location. Yeah. Client location found. Based on her current route, she will be arriving at the hollow exit in 30 minutes. So there's no way to stop her? No way. We can't leave saving the residents to Nekomata alone. If Vision is willing to resort to something so underhanded, they won't be easy to deal with. But our plan with the train failed, so how are we going to get the residents out? They don't have any aptitude for ether. Aww. If only there was a way to give corruption resistance to everyone at once. Uh, that's not just maybe we can look at another. I'll say this, yeah. Maybe we can shake things up a bit. Ever hear the saying, if the mountain can't come to us, we'll have to go to the mountain? Oh, I get it. Good idea. It could be dangerous, but it's the only way. Huh? What do you mean? Nicole, Canvas Street and New Eridu aren't that far apart as the crow flies. It's getting through the dead end hollow that takes so long. If we can shrink the hollow and gain access to the exposed roads, we can get the residents out in one go. Yeah! Then there's a chance! We're good at taking out ethereals! But to reduce the size of the hollow, we'd have to eliminate approximately 3,000 of them. <laughs> Under certain circumstances, the ether activity of certain giant individuals can reach or even exceed the equivalent of thousands of your standard ethereals. You've probably guessed by now. I mean the dead end butcher. Th that massive guy? He's way too big, however you look at it. If something goes wrong, I won't get to see Monica tomorrow night. <sighs> we certainly aren't a match for it alone. But don't forget, Vision left quite a few weapons lying around. We can help to ourselves to the eat their explosion, yeah. We could help ourselves to some of their ether explosives. Huh. So that's it. We use the explosives to take out the dead end butcher. Huh. It's like you said. A pretty crazy idea. But we don't have time to think about it. Let's get to work. Yeah, alright. Okay. The new plan involves using Vision's explosives. All their stock should be in here. Suggestion. Transport it with a vehicle. Good idea. Let's load the explosives onto the train.
Like, God damn it. Get in there. Warning. Neko Miyamana's biosignal detected. What? Where is she? Oh, she's the over there. The is about to reach the hollow exit. What's going on here? How did Director Perlman get tied up by a little girl? You're the person in charge? My request is simple. I'll return him to you as soon as Vision stops the demolition and gets the residents out. Oops. Forgot to introduce myself. I'm Neko Miyamana, but you can call me Neko Mata. That's right. I said I would negotiate, so I brought the proper bargaining chips. You mean to sacrifice yourself? How noble. How about it? And tell the public. Uh-oh. What, I, did he die? Let me give you some advice. Verify the value of your bargaining chip before you bring it to the table. Unfortunately, Mr. Perlman is not as useful to us as you might think. We have to hurry. Split into two groups and carry out the original plan. We're going to stall the dead end butcher, right? Yeah. Lure it to the target location. Leave the explosives train to us. Got it. We'll get going then. <laughs> I guess it's up to us. Okay. Let's get the train moving. Yeah, heck yeah. Let's keep going, motherfuckers. We'll go. We've got control of the train. I hope things go well for Nicole and the others. Yeah, we're going to fight. They're going to fight. Eh, 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 eh. We'll fight you motherfuckers. So empty out here. Are we sure that big guy's really around? Not sure about the big guy. Plenty of little guys, though. It must be hiding somewhere. Huh? The beasties are running away. Almost here. The monster? The theme song. What? <laughs> the bad guy's theme always plays before the final battle. Don't worry, Andy. I've mastered all the rules for a surefire win from the Starlight Knights. Gotta break the <laughs> rules when fighting bad guys. Take them out in less than 10 seconds with a flying kick. They won't even have time to play their theme song. Oh, shoot. <laughs> My predictions were out predicted. You big dummy! The only thing they'd be playing for you are the credits. Don't tell me this guy's a fan of the Starlight Knights, too. All right, we're gonna beat this motherfucker. This won't go down easily. You know, I kind of regret this. Billy, concentrate. Just hold oh, on dude. until the proxy gets here and we win. Okay. Oh. Andy, fall back. I'm coming. No point running! Starlight Garage! I'll show you! Hey, don't get it! Yeah, they dare you bastards. Oh, that was kind of easy, though. All right, more to entertain. All right, this little gun going tame me. Manager's still not here yet. Just a little longer. They're getting fatigued. 
<laughs> Not long ago. Ooh. So Pearlman was just a puppet? You're the one behind the demolition plan. That's not something you need concern yourself with. Miss Sarah, reports show a successful blast. The Vision Corporation is a disgrace! Down with the Vision Corporation! Yeah, look at them! <laughs> like we run this place. Oh, so you were able to get out of the blast zone? I'm impressed. On my order, open fire. Cops are here, you bitches! You think we're gonna kill us? Shoot? Hell no! This just in! A shocking scandal is developing around the Vision Corporation. Public security forces are currently cordoning off the scene and have subdued a number of unidentified individuals posing as law enforcement. Calling Director Zero. Calling Director Zero. We're surrounded by public security. Not just public security. Bellabog Industries is here too. Oh, these guys. <laughs> I knew Vision wouldn't give up easily. So I contacted Bellabog as we got out of the hollow. Reporting. All suspects have surrendered. No casualties among the residents. I heard they'll get our details soon, and we'll be taken to the station to give statements. It's you! Look, what are you doing? I'm the one who tried to get you killed, right? Your share for dinner, of course. Didn't we say, once we're done with the commission, we'll go out for dinner? Oh, well, is it really sad? Then consider this a formal invitation. Would you like to come to dinner with us? Hi. Unlimited macro? Then I'll have to think about it. Yeah. Anyway, thanks to Nekomata's connections within the Red Fang Gang, they won't be coming after us anymore. And I've made progress on what you asked me to investigate. According to the gang, they took part in stealing the Strongbox, but nobody knows where it actually came from. 
Apparently, Silver received a commission from a mysterious client. They were told to go to the Institute and get the Strongbox. But Silver didn't give the gang all the details, like how or to whom they were going to hand over the box, so nobody knows. Slow down. Did I hear you right? No one knows where it came from? Mystery client? Nobody knows the details? Yeah. It sounds like it. This is what you call progress. Uh, we haven't already considered your ancient fee. Didn't you say you'd made progress? But the Red Fang Gang had no idea about the Strongbox. But that Strongbox is really hard to look into. And I want to help those poor old residents who escape death get compensation as soon as possible. We saved them together after all. Thanks for the guilt trip, Nicole. We'll let you off the hook this time. That reminds me. What happened to Nekomata? I haven't seen her since that day. Ah, that little kitten. <laughs> About that. So she still left. Meow, meow, meow. Cat attack! They printed our group photo app. What do you think? It's good, right? Super clear. Come grab one. This one's for Wise, and this one's for Bell. Oh, <laughs> they went out to eat. Oh, that's kind of cool. <laughs> eh, what's wrong? You two look like someone just stole your favorite mackerel. <laughs> Nicole, playing on our heartstrings is a bit much. Don't even think about using the commission fee to cover what you owe. Just pay the 10% today. <laughs> Well said, Wise. <laughs> well said, Wise. Have mercy on me. I just wanted to surprise you. Ahem. Let me formally introduce to you the newest member of the Cunning Hairs. I'm Nekomiya Mana, but you can call me Nekomara. I work for the Cunning Hairs. I look forward to cooperating with you both, meow. All right. Oh, dang, I got a gold medal for that. <laughs> Alright, I think I'm going to end this video. Want more Party Kid Elite? Subscribe to the channel, leave a like, and comment down below. I'll see you guys again until the next video.